I am Anil Kumar and in this video we will learn how to write a number as an exponent of a different base. We have three examples here. Numbers given to us are 16, 81 and 10,000. Now when we have to write a number as an exponent and that too with different base, what should we do? We could write for example 16 as 4 times 4. Now 4 times 4 is 16 which is same as 4 square, right? So that is one way of doing it. Now we can write 4 as 2 times 2. So if I write each 4 as 2 times 2 and this 4 also as 2 times 2, what do I get? I get 2 as the base and exponent is 1, 2, 3, 4. So I get 2 to the power of 4. So when there is a question which says write each of the following as different exponents, we are trying to say that these are the numbers given to you. Write them with different exponents means different base and exponent or power combination. Right? Now I think you have understood the concept. You should try to pause the video and write down 81 and 10,000 as exponents of two different numbers. Here is how I will do it. 81 is what? 81 is 9 times 9. So I can write this as 9 square. And 9 can be written as 3 square, right? So that means 3 times 3. And then 9 as 3 square, 3 times 3. So what do we get? We get 3 to the power of 1, 2, 3, 4. So 81 can be written as 9 square or 3 to the power of 4. Now we have 10,000. 10,000. So 10,000 has 1, 2, 3, 4 zeros, right? That means we can write this as 10 to the power of 4. But you can also think 10,000 as two zeros, that means 100, times 100. And we can say 10,000 is 100 square. So that is how you can write a number in different forms. So the strategy here is you can find square root of the number. Square root of 16 is 4. So it is written as 4 square. And then square root of 4 is 2. So it could be written as 2 to the power of 4. So you can also find square root. If the numbers are big, then you can use calculator. So we'll take up another example where we'll deal with big numbers. You can use the calculator, find square root and write as an exponent. I hope you are enjoying this journey with me of learning exponents. Subscribe to my videos and learn more. Thank you and all the best.